So we've been practicing on how to convert hours to minutes. And by doing that, all we need to do is to multiply. For example, 60 minutes are in one hour. And if I want to find out how much six hours are in minutes, all I need to do is six times zero, zero, six times six, 36. I know that there are 360 minutes in six hours. Now, what if we are asked to convert minutes back to hours? So let me put an example here. I'm gonna put 400. Convert 400 back to hours and minutes. There are many ways to do this to convert it back to hours and minutes. But I'm going to show one of the ways that are most easy to follow. So what I'm going to do is look at this 400 minutes. The closest amount of minutes here that I have already calculated is 360. It's not bigger than 400, but it's the closest to 400. So what I'm going to do is write down my 400, subtract the 360 minutes because I know that that is already six hours. So I'm already figuring out here that there are six hours in that 400 minutes, but there are a few other minutes remaining. So what I need to do is subtract and I will find my answer. So I already know that six hours is in there. So I'm gonna put my six hours on my line. Now I need to figure out how many minutes are left because 400 minutes is bigger than 360 minutes. So let me go ahead and subtract. Numbers the same, zeros the game. More on the floor, go next door and get 10 more. So I call myself six and I count to 10. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10. My answer is four. And numbers the same, zeros the game. So 40 is left. So my answer is six hours and 40 minutes. Now, what if I have another example? What if there asking me to convert, let's say 340 minutes back to hours and minutes. The closest to 340 here that doesn't pass the 340 is 300. If I use this it's more than 340. If I use this, it's not the closest one. This is the closest one. So what I'm going to do is write down my 340, subtract the 300 minutes, which I know is equal to five hours. So now that I know there's already a five hour there, I could just put that on my line and then subtract to find my answer. Number's the same, zero is the gain. More on top, no need to stop. Number is the same, zero is the gain, and it gives me 40 minutes. So my answer is 340 minutes is 